It looked like a calm day for the Bersih 5.0 convoy until commotion broke up on Saturday. The organisers and speakers at the Sabah Bernam Lake thanked the Red Shirt Group for not ruining the activities to promote the upcoming Bersih 5.0 rally. Tak berlaku apa-apa yang tak tak ingin ni. Dan saya rasa kalau tak ada uh, mereka yang berbaju merah uh, untuk buat provokasi, saya rasa tak ada masalah. Persif 2.0 Chief Maria Chin Abdullah said the focus of her group was not to clash with the Red Shirt led by Sungai Besar Amnu Division Chief Datuk Jamal Yunus but to help roadshows to urge the people to make changes to the current administration. Despite the calm most of the day, the commotion happened when several men from the area's Amnu Division were said to have provoked a Persif supporter. The group also roughed up journalists from the Star Media Group and Malaysia Kini who were following the Bersih team to distribute brochures at the giant supermarket. They also demanded the journalists to delete footage from their phones and video recording devices. Policemen then put the situation under control and dispersed the group. Later in the evening, the journalists and Berse group lodged a police report on the incident. The convoy was also held simultaneously in Penang, Johor, Perak, Sabah, Sarawak and Kelantan. The Bersih 5.0 rally is scheduled to be held in Kuala Lumpur on November 19th.